Welcome back to the videos, you guys. This week we are back in Hawaii and the waves have been firing. So come along and watch some insane action. At LAX, another gorgeous morning at LA. We're going to Hawaii. It is that time of year again, folks. The helmet is packed. I even put my floaties in. Because you never know, it's El Nino. And um, we got our new DB bags. Thank you, DB. 10 day training camp. Molly's coming, Glenn's coming. Let's go. Okay, here we are. Right. Right. We made it, we were loaded. Oh boy. How many boards have we got in here? We got one. 12 boards in here and we're picking up another 12. Yeah, we are. Right now. Yeah, that's that's actually a great point. So I had all of my quiver for this year, well most of it, shipped here from Channel Channel Island shipped it to Hawaii for me, which is so nice of them. But I'm gonna go pick up this new quiver of boards. It's got a sick new spray on it. It's my main quiver for kind of the first half of the year. I'll fill in a couple little pieces. Past couple seasons, the WSL has started up in Hawaii. So it's really critical to have my boards dialed in for pipe sunset and the last few events before that mid-season cut. I'm so lucky to have people like Channel Islands to work with and create such great boards for me to surf on. This year's quiver is looking pretty and I hope you guys enjoy learning a bit more about it. We changed anything this year, Brett, or? We have, um, especially for lakes, I've just been working on the rails and the foils a lot you know she's got like a particular feel that she likes in her rail it's different than the guys and really different than uh, a lot of the surfers i'm shaping for which is cool she knows what she likes there she's communicated that i'm working on that rail that she loves in shortboards and just adapting that for over here in bigger waves and then working on the foils a bit for her just getting things more refined and uh, but also matching her strength and it's like a balance with lakey because Stuff has to be like super refined, but it's got to be able to handle her power. And she rides like a fine line of volume. She's kind of got to be just right. So it's a good challenge. And then uh, fin placements. I've been moving fin placements quite a bit for this year. I'm feeling pretty good about it. I won't say what it is or what I did, but it's pretty good. <laughs> I look fresh, I look sick. Right here we have all of Lakey's boards for Pipe and Sunset. They are all based off the boards that she had success on last year. At Pipe she got third. She was riding the CI Pro. Um, and she was riding the same CI Pros at Sunset. Unfortunately she broke her favourite 6.2. And this year we tried to make everything a little bit more simple and streamlined. So we've got the, the Pipe Rook and the CI Pro. Well, we're loaded up in the car. Food's now on my lap. This is about all this car can handle. We could fit all but one of our boards. We're gonna sticker them all up tonight. What do you guys think of the spray job? I was a little nervous to go for it because it's quite bold, but I, I like it. Let me know. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Give us your opinion. Here we are in Hawaii, baby. 23-24 season. Let's go.
Okay, we just had the first surf of pipe for the season. It was big and wonky and really, really scary. Um, it's so intense, especially when all the main guys are out there like they were today. It's really hard to get away if not that I was gonna go a set, but the intensity of the whole situation of the guys going and the wave itself is a lot. So it was a good reintroduction to it. And then now I think we're gonna go and surf sunset. It'll be big sunset um, and quite intimidating, but probably really good practice for the event. It is El Nino this year. So I'm thinking that our events are gonna be quite big over here in Hawaii. So just getting used to the intensity of it all and the guys in the lineup and just all that is happening between pipe and sunset, it's a lot to digest. So I'm gonna do my best and hopefully show you guys some clips. Let's go. Everything is just easy Since you told me what could become of me I put together all the pieces later like and subscribe thank you so much for watching you guys i hope you enjoyed this week's video we're still here in hawaii for another week so next week's video is going to be awesome leave a comment below i'm here with molly we're doing a training camp together and we'll do a little sit down and ask each other some questions you guys have been asking for the podcast so we'll do a little express version and if you have any questions for us to answer pop them below and we'll do our best and we'll put that in next week's video on friday thanks again guys See you soon.